would say certainly it's that 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 safety issue and that consumer issue of wanting to know what they're consuming, what's going into their body, so that they can make an educated choice whether they want to make sure that anything they're consuming has been genetically modified. So I think that was the most important point that the proponents of labeling brought up. It was interesting to hear from our farmers who grow these products how difficult it would be to sort of divide that out and it's going to impact the yield of what they're able to produce. If we do this labeling on a state basis, it becomes very difficult. How do we process it from the manufacturing plant that's perhaps can this product and they're in Iowa and they're shipping nationwide, how do they label it if Illinois is different than the other states? What we need to do is find out what is the best way of doing this. Is this something we should do on a state level? Is it something we should do on a federal level? And what, what's going to be the impact of those decisions? For all of us as a panel, when we do hearings like this, so that we can learn as much as possible, so when we pass a bill, it actually is the best bill we can pass and it makes sense to do it.